Alright guys, how we doing today? We got another edition of the Browns coming at you with the freshest and tastiest in all the brews. Today's episode, we're going to take a swig, uh, quick swing through Petaluma, California and uh, swing by the Lagunitas Brewery real quick and see what they got going on with their Hop Stupid. Um, this is most certainly a double IPA. Uh, it's in the neighborhood of 102 IBUs for you uh, is how it's labeled. You'll see that right there at the top. Um, quick mention, actually one thing I wanted to touch on, I think I've, I've I maybe have only vlogged about one other uh, Lagunitas beer before this, but huge ups to you guys for being able to label a beer and do it in an effective way. Like, I, I get agitated on a regular basis about trying to look and, and glean information from the bottle of a beer, and it seems like a lot of people spend a lot more time in the advertising phase than they do in just the delivering you the facts or stats about a beer. And I think these guys do a fantastic job of that. Um, Hop Stupid's 8% alcohol by volume, as previously mentioned, 102 IBUs. means it's going to be hoppy as all well get up. Uh, this is definitely for your hardcore hop heads. Uh, I think it's fantastic uh, in terms of an idea and a principle. And some of my very favorite beers are well over 100 IBUs. Um, this one... I don't believe I've ever had. So we're going to take a look at this and see what we got going. Okay, I'm seeing a bright, gorgeous hue. Uh, already just a, a huge bouquet. Now, I did pour that aggressively for a reason. Um, I always like to try and max out what I get out of the nose. And I'm already getting just a ton of floral, citrusy hops. This has got a nice light color to it. They didn't give it an overly heavy malt build more like a hazy light orange uh, typically the color of what you might expect a good pale ale to look like however this is deceiving because at 102 IBUs this is fantastic I haven't smelled anything like that since since Sweetwater's Border Hopper their double IPA that featured only Citra hops or maybe even Hopzilla which was Terrapin Side Project 13 There is resin there. It's not pine cone resiny. Uh, it's not over the top resiny. Um, but you can definitely tell that they, they maxed out the hops for what they're worth. This has got a fantastic head to it, and I think the color's amazing. I haven't even tasted it yet. Soapy, sudsy, extremely hop forward. And yet, for 102 IBUs, I would say that it has a very clean finish to it. Um, malt in these beers is typically only used to drive or further drive the hop flavor. And this one is really well done. Um, it's very much just a crash of hops at the beginning. Um, and just a really, really well done finish. What's also fantastic about this, again, is what Lagunitas can do about providing awesome 22-ounce bombers. Like, if you don't have all day to sit around and drink, spend your way chugging through a 30-pack or something like that, you've got time to have, like, a solid beer before you got to get back to it and get back with the rest of your life. This is a fantastic way to go. Uh, this probably ran me under 5 bucks. Um, very, very well done. Congratulations to the guys at Lagunitas. Hop Stupid is a huge hit with a bunch of the hardcore beer faithful I've talked to already. Um, I'm definitely a fan. We look forward to trying more from you guys in the future. This has been The Rounds, bringing you the freshest and tastiest in all the brews. I'm Glenn. Find a beer, find a friend, make something happen. We'll see you guys later on The Rounds.